All right, so here's a cool trick for you guys. So the part of my dash instrument cluster is broken. You can see the crack in it right there, All right? So this isn't gonna be a super great fix, but it'll kind of work. So what I've done is just taken my soldering iron and I put a kind of a flat nail in it. Let's see if that'll focus, there we go. Anyways, I just wanted a flat surface because this will get hot. And uh, this is made of a kind of plastic that actually will melt. So you can get in here, if my phone will focus, so you can kind of just run it on here, it'll kind of melt it. So you can see kind of melt and smear the plastic, er, there we go. Kind of smelt, smear it around a little bit, so I kind of smear this around a bit and fill, fill in this crack a little, uh, get it to hold up some. And then you can actually come back if you get another piece of plastic from uh, any kind of plastic that's meltable and you can actually just tri cut some off and uh, melt it over the top of this as a patch. So, so let's see if we can get in here a little bit. So you can see it's smearing the plastic around. So I'm just gonna kinda melt and try to glue this back together somewhat for now. Good enough. All right, here you go guys. Jerry-rigged repair of the day. So I'm just kinda working on some wiring and stuff today. This is the back of my instrument cluster. Uh, so what I got going on here is, uh, I don't know if you can see it, all the little standoffs. Let me see if this will focus. Um, all the little standoffs in here that uh, the windshield wiper switch would normally screw onto or broken off. So I needed some way to mount this. So I went back to the old uh, 3M double-sided sticky tape. That's what I put on there. Just kind of uh, stuck four pieces around the edges of where the switch would mount and stuck it on there because it just sits flat against the square hole there. Uh, this is the stuff right here, 3M. It's like double-sided uh, molding tape. Really good stuff. Uh, a lot of car moldings are held on with nothing more than this. Even newer cars, and they, I mean, they don't ever fall off hardly. So it's really good. But I stuck it on there. Um, you know, pressed it on. It's it's pretty firm. I don't think it's gonna come off or go anywhere for a while. Just got to make sure everything's cleaned up. So you know, on the other side here. Can't really tell. Switch is in there. No, oh, works just fine. It's not like loose or anything. So go with that. Uh, still got this other bracket here. I think maybe all uh, this goes kind of like that. So normally the screws would go through here and here and hold it on. And uh, well, the headlight bolts through here, so that'll kind of help hold it in place, I guess. But I'll probably double sided tape it onto here and here, too. Uh, so, anyways, kind of a tip of the day, I guess. Double sided sticky tape, it's good stuff. Use it. Catch you guys later.